Hello guys, what is up? Beckbrojack here, back for another tutorial, and today I will be showing you how to install Minecraft mods. I hope you guys enjoy. a tutorial uh, on how to install Minecraft mods uh, for 1.7 or really any version of Minecraft. This should work for any version. So yeah, a lot of you guys have been suggesting that. So I decided that I would finally do it. Uh, I did a tutorial a while back on how to install Minecraft Forge and uh, that did pretty well. A lot of people like that and it did help them out. But a lot of people were having errors and such so I just decided to make a video specifically on how to get mods. So uh, yeah, we're gonna start off here. All the links will be in the description below. So uh, this is our first place that we're going to need to go. Uh, this is where we're going to get Minecraft Forge. So once you're on this page, um, you're going to go over to Minecraft version. Whatever uh, mod that you're downloading, whatever version it's for, that's what you're going to click on. Today I'll be showing you how to do it for 1.7.2. So uh, this is the latest version of Forge at the moment, but when it does update, obviously you can just hit that version and uh, download it. So we're going to go uh, 1.7. 7.2 latest and make sure that you hit installer for whatever version you're downloading it for So we're going to hit that. Oh, you have to wait for the ad fly page to load Make sure that you don't have ad blocker or anything because that will uh, you know give you an error and ad fly will not work So uh, make sure that uh, you also hit keep down here. It'll say that it can harm your computer um, It will not harm your computer This is just you know, a mandatory thing that Google must say because any download could potentially harm your computer But this is one of those safe downloads so you're just going to hit keep and we're going to drag this over here because uh, we're going to need to click on this forge. So you're going to click on this. Uh, if it doesn't automatically open with, uh, you know, Java, you're just going to right, you're going to right click on it uh, in the folder. So you're going to find that in your downloads and then you're going to right click on it and hit uh, open with Java. And uh, it should open up this, the mod system installer. And you're going to hit install client and make sure that the file that it's going to be going to is correct. Uh, normally it can find Minecraft for you. So uh, all you really need to do is hit OK. So it'll download Minecraft Forge for you. It should say successfully installed, uh, you know, all this good stuff where it'll say that it is complete. So, um, yeah, let's, uh, let's go over here. Uh, just uh, one quick note before uh, we go on. Um, if you haven't run Minecraft uh, 1.7.2 vanilla like manually at least once, it'll give you an error that says you need to run Minecraft, whatever version you're trying to download Forge for, at least one time. Just because of the fact that Forge needs something to copy and mod for you. Because if it doesn't have a based file to work off with, um, it won't, uh, you know, have anything to mod and it'll give you an error. So just make sure that you run uh, whatever version you're trying to download Forge for at least once without uh, any mods. So, um, yeah, so now that we got that out of the way, you're going to uh, run percent app data percent and then hit enter. So uh, you're just going to navigate to your dot Minecraft folder. We're going to drag this over here and you're going to up, uh, go into your dot Minecraft. And um, you might already have a mods folder, but if you don't, uh, I made sure to delete my mods folder just in case uh, a lot of you do not have it. This is your first time installing mods. So you're just going to right click, hit new, and go on to folder. And then I'll give you a new folder and you have to just type in mods. This is case sensitive, so make sure there's no uppercase or anything like that and make sure you have the S. And then boom, this is your mods folder that uh, your Minecraft launcher will access when trying to load mods. Also, uh, just a... Uh, you know, if you want to be careful and uh, make sure that you have Forge, all you have to do is go under versions and you should see uh, a 1.7.2 Forge or whatever version you were downloading it for. You should see that, uh, you know, it has installed for Forge. So now that we have that, uh, this is where you actually put in your mods. So whatever mods that you have installed, I mean, whatever you uh, downloaded, now is the chance to put them in. So you're gonna open your mods folder, and I have these three mods over here. I have uh, Damage Indicators, Optifine, and Shaders mod. These are the mods that I use in most of my videos. So I'm just going to drag them into here. Now, uh, sometimes it's different, so just make sure to read the Minecraft uh, page that you're getting the mods off of. Make sure um, if they have any directions, just follow them. Most of them will just say just to drag their mod uh, download into the mods folder. So this is what the, the normal thing is for uh, mods. So you're just going to drag them into the mods folder. And uh, yeah, you're really done with that. You don't need this, so you can close it out. And now is when you're going to go into your Minecraft launcher. 
So let's uh, open that. Let's wait for that to boot up. All right, so this is where you have to uh, get yourself a new profile. So uh, I already have a mods profile, but say that you didn't already have one. Uh, Forge will actually create one for you, but um, if you wanted to edit that one, so let me just hit play. Uh, you can hit Forge and then hit Edit Profile. So as you can see, it already made a version for you uh, where you know it has uh, the 1.7.2 Forge, where uh, if you just hit Play on the Forge Profile, it will automatically load the, load the mods for you. But uh, what I like to do is I just like to allocate more RAM to Minecraft. Um, I normally will do uh, half of whatever RAM that your computer has. So if your computer has four RAM, uh, then I would do two gigabytes of RAM towards Minecraft. So uh, that's really the only thing that I would change in here. And you can hit save profile. And uh, all you have to do is hit play. So we'll just wait for that to boot up, uh, but our mod should be loaded fine. All right, guys, so here uh, you can see that Minecraft has loaded. I'll make that full screen for you. Uh, you can hit on the mods folder um, just to see that it has worked. But um, I have been getting a strange error where I, if I do hit on the mods right here, uh, it, Minecraft will crash. That might just be because uh, Forge is, you know, in a little bit of a beta because, you know, Minecraft 1.7 was updated within the past few months. So it's still uh, working out some kinks and bugs and stuff like that. But anyway, uh, just to show you that it works, uh, I'll just create a whole new world. We just call it uh, Test Mod World. I'll just show you that the mods have worked. So we'll just, uh, you know, load up this world. And, uh, yeah, I'll just, you know, clarify that everything has worked so far. Just so you don't think I'm bluffing or anything. And uh, if you do have a problem, though, just make sure to leave it in the comments below. And I can either help you or um, I can try and help you. Maybe you might have to submit something uh, to the mod maker that you're trying to download the mods from. So as you can see, uh, Shaders mod is working. Uh, what's another mod that's in here? There's a damage indicator, so if I just get a pig little piggy you can see that I have damage indicators in the top left um, if you want any of these mods obviously you can just google them I'm not gonna put a download link just because of the fact that um, you know this isn't really a mod uh, this re I'm sorry this isn't really a video about that this is just for installing mods so uh, this is my hero bind pig I edited the texture so don't freak out in the comments that this is like a hero bind pig and he's gonna come and kill you while you're sleeping trust me he's a nice piggy so yeah guys anyway this has been Beckbro Jack here showing you how to install mods for Minecraft. I really hope you guys did enjoy. Let's see if we can pound 40 likes. If we can get 40 likes for this video, that would be freaking sweet. So, you guys, anyway, my name is Beckbro Jack, and I will see you guys all next time. Bye!